Hello friends, my name is Sachin and in this video tutorial you are going to learn how to change Windows VPS administrative password on Windows Server 2019 machine. This video tutorial is presented by Sachin Sami powered by itcoz.com and you are watching this video on YouTube channel PDKRIS. You got a problem? I have a solution. Before we start. Just click on the subscribe button so that you can receive the email updates and click on the bell icon. So previously the server which we have bought have a default password. So right now I am on the control panel or you can say on the server panel which is provided by the hosting provider. If you have not seen the previous video, this is the details which was given by the hosting provider to log in onto the server. So if I click on the show password, the password is shown. This is the initial password which we require to change. So let's connect back to the server and we are going to change the password now. Click on download and the shortcut downloads for the server. Click yes. Like previously, we have saved the password on this computer, which is our initial password. So we are able to log in directly without entering the password. So if we have not saved the password, we couldn't able to log in and then we have to manually enter the password. So this time we have directly logged in. And now I'm going to change the password. To change the password, go to start. And then click on server manager. All right. From the server manager, go to tools. And from the tools, click on computer management. After that, click on local users and groups. Then click on the arrow sign to expand the local users and groups. Select the users folder. Here you can see there are multiple users, all are disabled except the administrator. So right click on the administrator and then click on set password. Click on proceed. Enter the new password. Alright. And then we have to confirm the password by entering the same password once more. Click OK. We get the confirmation message that the password is set. Now let us disconnect from the RDP server. And now we are going to reconnect to the RDP VPS server. And we are going to see whether it is asking for the new password. So in the Windows search menu, we are going to search for remote desktop connection. This opens up the remote desktop connection window. Now previously when we have clicked on connect, it got directly connected without asking for the password. But this time it will ask us for the password because we have changed. Okay, so enter the new password which we have set. So let me quickly enter the password. And now we are able to connect to the server. So as you can see, we are successfully able to connect to the server using the new password. It completes our this video tutorial. If you like the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. In our next video tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can host a website on your Windows Server 2019 machine. Hello friends, my name is Sachin. Hope you like this video. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. This video tutorial is presented by Sajin Zami powered by itzoz.com and you are watching this video on YouTube channel Peter Grice. You got a problem? I have a solution.